Hi, I'm here at work right now. Um, Jane is at school and Charlotte is taking a nap, so I have a break. And uh, I don't know if you can hear or not, but there's construction going on outside, which is kind of driving me nuts. Lots of beeping trucks. I think there's construction behind their house, and then there's also construction out on their street. So it's like coming from both sides. So anyway, um, so I just wanted to update a little bit on the, how things are going this week. I'm doing antibiotics this week again, which is going okay. Um, I had to adjust my antibiotic schedule because of I was get I got a shipment of antibiotics that was delivered, but then the it was delivered and signed for at my leasing office, and then the leasing office closed early, and I didn't get there before they closed because I didn't know they were closing early. And anyway, so I didn't manage to get the shipment in time to do my normal days. Um, so, uh, so I've had to adjust my schedule this week so that I'm doing it today, which is Thursday, um, and I'll do it on Saturday. Um, so it's going along okay. Um, Monday was rough because I did Monday and then now Thursday and Saturday. Monday was kind of rough with a lot of nausea and just not feeling great. I don't even remember really what I did on... Oh, I had a counseling appointment and... Yeah, I don't really remember a lot about Monday. But, um, it was... Um, the side effects kind of hit me as they... Do. I mean, it, they seem to often do that. This morning, again, it seems like the morning dose is the hardest. Um, the ones later in the day aren't quite as bad. The first one of the day is the worst. So, it's, I mean, it's then, then it makes it harder to, when the first one is so hard, it's hard to push through and do the second one and the third one. But anyway, um, I have a cold, uh, which I think is partly from Eric, who had a little bit of a cold last week, but mostly from Jane and Charlotte, because they have been dealing with a cold for, well, this week. I mean, they've kind of had a little bit of a cold for a while, but it's been worse this week, um. And Jane was out of school yesterday with pink eye. So I get to see kind of the other side of the, you know, kid illnesses from when I was teaching. I get to see the side where, like, the kids are sick enough to not go to school, but um, not sick enough to need mom or dad to stay home. So uh, we'll see how, we'll see how able I am to stay well through this. Um, I, I'm trying to drink a lot. I'm drinking a lot of tea today and uh, taking, using emergency and uh, I have, I got vi regular just vitamin C um, capsules yesterday also. And trying to do what I can do. So anyway, um, so that's that. Um, not a whole lot else has been going on. I had uh, a really long day yesterday at work. I had to get in early and then was, and Jane was home from school, so it was just a long day. Um, and this whole week has just felt really long because um, Tuesdays are always really long for me. So anyway, I don't really have a lot of anything else to say. Um, I feel like I'm still dealing with a lot of ups and downs mood-wise. Um, so, I mean, I'm, I'm dealing with them and um, I talked about a lot of stuff with my counselor, which was really good. 
and I see her again in a couple weeks. So, I mean, I'm I'm managing with what I'm managing with, but it's kind of hard when I don't know what's going to bring on the ups and downs and, you know, you can't really predict. Um, and I was reminded this week when someone posted a quote on Facebook that those kind, that kind of crankiness, and mood swings, and all those things can be explained by the Lyme causing inflammation in your brain. So, I mean, that explains a lot because I am dealing with a lot of Lyme stuff right now and herxing and all of that. So, anyway, um, so that's pretty much it. Um, well, I was, uh, at work this morning while I was playing with Charlotte and trying to occupy her, um, we took a little, we did a little video on my computer, so I'm actually going to end with that. So, talk to you soon. Did you blow a kiss? Mm -hmm. Can you say bye-bye? Bye-bye.